across the spectrum of housing experiences, even when we look at something like people who are homeless or are sleeping rough, COVID aggravated things that were already in place and made it harder to get access to even maybe slightly precarious housing. And then I see in Montreal something, there's this idea that it's always been not Toronto or not Vancouver. And, and we see that that's no longer really a reality if it ever was, and it was. But something I always look at is also this financialization of housing. So when we see housing as a commodity, you know, condos sitting empty and kind of being seen as investment rather than homes. And so if thinking of the right to housing, what does that mean when we have people who don't have any home at all and we're keeping homes empty because they aren't going to be making the right money or they're not going to be attracting the right kind of people. So seeing things like rent evictions, seeing things like kicking people out of homes to rapidly raise rent, it creates, yeah, a crisis for sure.